I need only people on my YouTube that really fuck with me. Period. You know, bae, I hope you really fuck with me. I really, that's what I want. I want a community. Promise to always be loyal and tell you the truth. I ain't never gonna lie to your face. Mama that's my man. Hey babe, welcome back to my channel. It's your girl Zakia, also known as Extra, period. Uh, so today is Monday. I decided, I guess I'll start a vlog. We are heading to, we just got to the mall. We're gonna head to go make a return and also get some stuff for some other content that I have coming out. So make sure you subscribe to the channel. Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe, period. Oh my God, I gotta get this hair out of my head. It's time. Look at, like, look at this. I'm so tired. Everybody ain't got a piece of my hair. <laughs> Baby bought me some shoes to make me feel better. She surprised me with some shoes from Steve Matt, and so that was really sweet of her wrist So yeah, so now we're gonna head to return. Anyway, yeah, so I'll see y'all when we get to Steve Matt. And look at my skin though. Okay, you girl, look at Okay, period. Ah. I feel like I just have to squint to put that thing on. fourth of a way there a fourth of a way there six more weeks to go before we finish so I think we're gonna finish around August 1st but anyway um, this is our dinner we didn't really eat that much today I did have some oranges earlier so we have some more oranges and a bowl of watermelon and that's gonna be our dinner I have lost seven pounds um, I started at 173 and I am at 166 Okay, bitch. What are you doing? Like, why are you driving like a fucking dumbass? Sorry. <laughs> that was me. Shit. Sorry, y'all. I am heading to. Ooh. Oh my. I'm heading to therapy. Ugh. I haven't been feeling like going for some reason. I don't know why, but I it just has not been like. <sighs> I haven't been like pumped to go. But that's probably because I actually really need to do some work. I really need to go. That's why my body is like, don't go. Stay in the bed, be late, don't go. So, I'm happy that I'm pushing myself to go. Um, yeah. And we came home and we watched um, Lily and Nick and Carla. We've been watching them, their reactions to Lily. Um, 
that we took a deep dive into all of Lily's things that she's been going through this year. Man, shout out to Lily. I was just amazed by her strength. This past 2021, I was just like, man, I fucking get it, girl. I've been there and I just see her, her strength. It's been crazy. So if you, um, yeah, if you can vibe with that, I feel like you should go and check out Life of Lily or Lily Yours Truly or Nick and Carla's channel because, um, yeah, her story is like, when you was fucking with a fuck boy, like my God. And for eight years, oh my gosh. Shit, I done been through stuff for two years, so eight years I could just, oh my God. My heart literally was pouring out to her like she had me crying, you know? So check out her videos. Anyway, love you, love you bae. I'll talk to you when I get out of therapy, bye. Hey bae, I am back after my therapy session. It actually went really good. I'm gonna insert some small clips of what we talked about. Shifting my focus to what can I do? What is within my ability to control, right? Okay. And generally that comes all the way down to just the, the one thing that we can control is just this, right? So yeah. I can't change things. I can only change me. Kind of, right? You yeah. Know what you're I mean, that's that's my perspective, right? Mm -hmm. That I don't have the ability to to change how someone sees, you know, me. I can just be me. It's really hard for me to just be like to just sit and accept mm -hmm. that I'm right here in this place. Yeah. Because I'm like, I'm supposed to be in a different. I'm place. supposed to go somewhere else, right? And and that's that's the piece of it that becomes the challenge, right? Because radical acceptance doesn't mean I give up or I give in, or I'm okay with it. It doesn't mm -hmm. even mean I like it. Mm -hmm. I just acknowledge that mm, this is where I'm at today. Cause this moment is the only one I have like right here, right now. Yeah. And today I'm not able to change this. So what, what can I change? What, what can I do today? Right. She was really helpful. Today I found out some new things that I didn't know are new ways to go about life that I didn't know and that made me feel really good um she told me about this thing called the serenity prayer I'm gonna see if I can find it and I can read it to you all maybe I should look it up now actually grant me the serenity to accept the things I cannot change courage to change the things I can and wisdom to know the difference living one day at a time enjoying one moment at a time Accepting hardship as the pathway to peace. Taking as Jesus did this sinful world as it is, not as I would have it. Trusting that you will make all things right. If I surrender to your will, that I may be reasonably happy in this life and supremely happy with you forever in the next. I battle with accepting when things are not going the way that I expected. So, um, yeah, she helped me a lot with that. I just like how she thinks, so I'm excited. I really did not want to go today, but I'm happy that I went. When I got there and we talked, I feel like I... I feel like it was good. Anyway, um, so now I'm at uh, Bloomingdale's, and I'm actually about to run in and get some things. Hopefully, i also have to look for some things for my boss. So yeah, let's get to it. Also, I realized that I have on the same clothes from yesterday. It was one of the mornings. I just had to, um, yeah, I rolled, rolled out a bit. But, um, so I'm going in here, I have to get some things for me to do a video and also I have to get something for my bus um, and to take it to her tomorrow. Um, and maybe I'll take you guys to work with me tomorrow. I'm never uh, taking y'all to work, so that'll be fun. Maybe I'll insert this actually into the vlog tomorrow as well. Let's see, we're at Bloomingdale's. We're at Bloomingdale's. Hey, how are you? You're a YouTuber? 
Yes. <laughs> oh, I'm getting into that. <laughs> oh, really? Yeah. Oh, that's I'm, good. I'm buying my camera right yeah. now. Me and my best friend are doing vlogs. Oh, that's so. Oh, oh my God. God. What's your channel? Pinky Saroha. Pinky Saroha. Can you write it down? You gotta come see Pinky at Bloomingdale. Uh, Period. <laughs> a dedicated saleswoman. <laughs> Bloomingdale. Here, I'm gonna shoot you the link. Okay. Um, when I got my phone downstairs. Okay, that sounds great. And I'm gonna be support you, whatever you're doing. Oh, that's awesome. Thank you. Oh, I saw your camera. I get excited to see the YouTube vlog. I'm like, hey, what's up, girl? Here you go, that's me. Awesome, I got you. Thank you. Thank okay, you. we gotta talk. My man is my man is your man, her is her man too. My man is my man is your man, her is her man. Tuesday and Wednesday, Thursday and Friday, I just keep him satisfied. Well, I got the goods. I got the goods now. I'm out of here. It's so pretty outside. Wow. I got the goods. Got what I needed. Um, got what my boss needed. So hopefully it'll work for her as well. And yeah. That's it. Um, I'm going to stop at the store because I want to surprise my baby with some flowers. And... Then I'm gonna head home and hopefully edit a video. <sighs> Our air has been out for the past five days. So I haven't been able to get very much work done because who wants to work when it's freaking hot, muggy? Who wants to put on makeup when I'm about to sweat? Like, no, can't do it. So um, hopefully our air comes back on tomorrow and I can get some work done as well um, after I get home from work. So yeah, we'll see. This how you doing me today? Well, you always come meet me. I know, but I want to make sure I have kids. Uh, uh, oh, you got flowers. Those are cute. They're yeah, for you. For me? Yeah. Baby. Oh. Thank you, baby. Thank you. Can you talk about that? It's black. Mm. I was trying to get fruits ready for you because you said you was hungry. That's for you, baby. Thank you so much oh, for baby. everything you do. Baby. I love you so much. You always make me feel so good. Mm. You're so supportive. Thank you, baby. You always got my back. Oh, I got some flowers. And you always helping me out, and I just appreciate you You're so, so much. so sweet, baby. Mm -hmm. So, I love you. Mm. Like, what? What? Ooh. It's just healthy. Ooh. It's giving healthy. It's giving good skin. <laughs> it's giving weight loss. My baby's so sweet sometimes. <laughs> I'm done. Bye, y'all. By the time you looked away, already knew I couldn't fake it. I got this need for you. Four minutes of beating heart. Yesterday we worlds apart I got this thing for you If you come closer I can whisper in your ear And if you wanna walk away I'll tell you all the things I know you wanna hear Thank you.
We made Taco Tuesday. Tacos. This has, ooh, it looks so beautiful. Oh my God, it looks so gorgeous. This is a um, lettuce wrap, which is a lettuce taco with cauliflower meat, um, mashed avocado, and it has yellow pepper salsa on it and cilantro. And this one is just avocado, mashed avocado, mango salsa, peppers and onions on top and cilantro mm. baby has the same looks so delicious i'm excited i'm very excited and then we have uh, our pesto sauce that we made a couple days ago and this is her new habanero salsa okay so this is day 14 um the night of day 14 been feeling pretty good hey babe welcome back to my channel uh it's the i don't know i left this vlog off um leaving the mall I, I went to work yesterday yeah i didn't really i didn't vlog at all i'm sorry my apologies it is now thursday and um i was eating some watermelon i just wanted to come on here man the last two days has been really frustrating yeah lots of arguments just tough stuff going on in your in your in your life tough stuff um and just trying to figure out how to maneuver through those things you know it's tough um and i'm on this cleanse that i really wanted to break this is day what like 16 i think and i really wanted to break that sucker because i was just like you know what i'm over this especially if everything else in my world is like falling apart but you know they say when it rains it storms and it really do be storming okay um sorry for yawning but i'm really hoping i feel better today i'm gonna get some work done and push forward i decided yesterday to unfollow everybody on my instagram page I'm not mad about it though. It was needed. And I made a post. I said, I'm about to unfollow everybody for my mental health. If you unfollow me, because I unfollowed you, I understand. It, it's no, it's, it's literally no beef. No hard feelings. I was just like, you know what? I need, I need only people in my life that really fuck with me. You know what I mean? I need only people on my YouTube that really fuck with me. Period. You know, bae, I hope you really fuck with me. I really, that's what I want. I want a community of people that really fuck with Zakia, with Extra, with me, personally, with me. They want to see me succeed. I want to see y'all succeed as well. You know, I want us to grow together, lift each other up. It's so important. So... I went down from 970 so now I have a hundred people that I'm following and I'm going to finish it today so I'll make sure I show that on the vlog Clean the bathrooms yesterday so i have that video going up today i need to sit down and edit it that's going to be going up tonight and um i'm at 165 pounds that's feeling good like you can find you can see my waist again you know last night me and baby played trouble and we like to play trouble and then ask questions if you send somebody home so um instead of asking questions we just i was like maybe we should manifest so anytime someone was sent home, you had to say something that you were manifesting. So that was really fun. Um, just to kind of put those energies out into the universe. Because I am manifesting a lot. And I feel like my life... It has a purpose. 
it has a purpose even though things are moving kind of slow it has a purpose and i have to be the one to put my foot right in front of the other to keep getting to where i gotta go it's just hard especially when other things around you are crumbling you know so it's like you just gotta keep pushing through we gonna push through together just gotta keep pushing through i am worthy i am worthy i am worthy i deserve i am worthy all right i'm gonna show y'all my watermelon <laughs> Mm. Almost choke. I know most people be like, it ain't nothing left on there. I like to eat it to the pink gong. Now I'm done. Mmm. Let me show y'all something funny. Look at how many avocados baby bought. She went to the store. Cause we're still not eating cooked food. As you know, if you've been watching, you know what's going on. What? This is like an avocado house. We got a few ones that are not ripe that we'll eat as they get ripe. But then we have some, I told her to get some that were ready to go. These baby ones are taking a while to get ripe, but we've been sitting them out. Ooh, this one feel good. So bae, I'm about to be real vulnerable. Are y'all ready for the vulnerability? Are you ready for the vulnerability? I need to do this room. I need to finish my studio so that I can actually work in my studio. I remember when this room was empty and look at it. It's ridiculous. I need to finish it so I can do get ready with me's in here again. I can use my green wall. Like, it has to be done. So we're gonna work on it. Now I'm about to show it and reveal. It looks crazy, but it's really not that bad. But it's kind of bad, but it's kind of not bad, but it's kind of bad. <laughs> oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Okay, this is what I gotta deal with. So I'm gonna do a time lapse and you can see me working on it for sure. I want this space clean today, even if the whole room isn't done. You see we got bins, we are starting to organize, but I need this area clean so I can at least do these couple videos that I've been wanting to get done, but I can't get them done if I can't get the space clean. So this is my project for the day. So let's get to it. Y'all are currently in a box. <laughs> okay. Well, at least you'll see this part. At least I'm going to sort my clothes. This is ridiculous. I used to have a very cute little laundry basket when I had my cleaning lady. And now this is my laundry. See, this has to change. This has to change! Because this is not sexy or cute or like anything. It's just annoying. Really. It's just really annoying.
Hey, babe. Why am I up at... What time is it? 11.48. Editing. Like, I'm working on content for my babes. Um, I love y'all so much. You already know. Uh, the noise in the background is rain music, so that um, it's calming and you can sleep. But anyway, I cannot believe that I'm up right now editing. I'm trying to knock out some work because I really want to stay consistent. I've been being really consistent knocking out these videos. I hope that you guys are enjoying the content um, because, yeah, you're my bae. And I want um, to just stay consistent. I want you to enjoy what you're watching. I want you to see the effort that's being put into it. Uh, this video right here is a two camera video. It'll probably be out tomorrow, so it'll, this is kind of late. It'll be late in the vlog, but, or later, this vlog will come out later, but yeah, I'm just trying to be consistent, keep going, keep pushing, even through any of the frustrating moments because it's been some hard days, these past couple days. And, um, but that doesn't, I'm not gonna stop. Because I know my worth, I know my potential, I know what I deserve. And I know what God has intended for me. And I just got to keep going. Period. Period. I'm going to do some story times. Comment down below if you guys would like some story times. I'm going to be doing some story times for you, babe. And, um, just, I got some funny things that have happened in my life and I think you would enjoy it. So, yeah. Uh, some things mostly about work. And I am going to start recording work. I just need to get into the habit of doing it. So, that'll be coming up soon, soon too. So, yeah. But I'm over here editing. That's all I'm doing. Uh, like I said, it's 11.50 at night. So, I'm going to have to finish this video tonight so that it can go up tomorrow. Okay? I'll talk to you soon. Bye. Good night. Well, I do have something that... Hi, guys. That I, I look real crusty dusty. It's okay. I ain't going to look like this later on. I'm going to get cute. Um, I'm going to get cute tonight. I'm going to get cute tonight. But, um... We're watching The Tiny Desk with Usher. Woo! I was with my ex-girlfriend. My chick on the side said she got one away. Listen, the thing is, what's so fucking funny is, everybody thought this was about Usher. So we was like, that dirty ass! How you gonna cheat on Jelly? And now you saying it ain't even real. Everything is fake. Everything is an illusion. All right, bye y'all. to you I was um doing Pilates so I hope you enjoyed some of that content uh it was really fun we are about to head to see you soon it's an event in LA um a music event and 
our good friend Maya is, or y'all know her as Weirdo with Soul, is DJing there tonight. So this is a really big gig for her because she's DJing with Erie Hall, who is a celebrity DJ. So that's lit, and I'm so excited and so proud of her. Make sure that y'all, um, you know, spam the comments with go DJ Weirdo. <laughs> so anyway, we're heading out there. Um, I will show y'all my outfit. And yeah, we're about to get out of the house because we're running late, so we need to hurry up and go. Okay. Period. <laughs> hey, babe. So we are on our way to see Maya. We're the whistle. Um, we were running a bit behind, but uh, the event kind of was started off a little like unorganized, so it's okay. Um, I'm wearing body. I got body and I'm wearing body. Okay. Body by Raven tonight. Um, I decided to throw on something new, which I usually don't do. So that's kind of different for me. Uh, yeah, so we're going to have some fun. I'm excited to go out. We haven't been out. And you know we're not eating and we're not drinking. So we got water. And that's it. Damn, that thing came out. We got some water and that is it. Look, this water bottle I got from an old friend of mine and it says strong on it. Strong. Anyway, yeah, we are eating, but we're not eating cooked food. So it's not like I can go get McDonald's over this, which is what we would normally do. <laughs> After this, I'm gonna get some watermelon, which actually sounds better and oranges and apples. Oh, I haven't had an apple in a couple days. Ooh, ooh, or a salad. Ooh, maybe I should make a fruit salad. Yeah. But like a fruit salad with that salad. salad I made. Yeah, mangoes, apples, um, I oranges. Know about, I don't know about. You ain't never had apple slices in a salad? I have, but I don't think I really like that. It's delicious, and then you use like a raspberry vinaigrette. See, I'm not a raspberry type of person. Well, you can use balsamic. See, I'm not a fruity salad it's, person. I said balsamic. You never had, girl, I gotta make you with salad. Spinach salad with apples, walnuts, um, Parmesan cheese, uh, cucumbers. Ooh, baby. That's delicious. Mm. Yeah, can't wait. Nah, you really, I, I gotta, I'm gonna make that for her because she crazy. She crazy. So we are only nine minutes away, so we'll be there very soon. Um, yeah, I'm excited. I'm gonna try to stop saying uh. It annoys me when I say uh. And it's just like a natural thing. It's so annoying. Why is that? Is that because we can't, we don't know what we're gonna say, so we say uh. It's really annoying. It really is. I gotta work on that. Maybe that's really interesting. What? Now I'm just thinking and talking. Oh, you saw the fireworks? Oh, yeah, that was cool. oh no, I didn't see him. Ooh, my makeup. Good. Okay, glowy. Oh, look, I just did it. Oh my god. <laughs> that, that one was warranted. What? Um, that um. What's the transition um? No, I don't want you. I don't even want transition um. Oh, okay. You have to just be able to not say anything until you know what you're about to say. Every time you say um, you gotta put a dollar. It's this woman that I met. Her name is Janaya. You probably have met her. I think her name is Janaya. They have another name for her. See, I was just about to do it. I went to go see her uh, one time do a speech, and she spoke so eloquently, so perfect. For two hours, she never said um. She don't say it. Like she just talks and thinks as she's talking and just says what the next thing is that she wants to say I without saying uh, yes like I was just doing it you just have hard. to think about it <laughs> talk a little talk like a slower <laughs> see yeah I'm really gonna work on that because I don't nah, I don't really like it but I was just thinking something. When you watch scripted shows or like movies and stuff like that, you realize that sometimes where, where it doesn't sound real is because they don't have the same 
natural things that normal people do. Mm -hmm. Like say um. I've never heard um in a movie or a TV show. I've heard it, but it's usually when they're thinking like um, you know. You've heard it? I've heard it. So you think um is written in the script? Yeah, for sure. Especially, it's a thinking word. It's like um. Or it's a thinking sound, I feel yeah. like. It's not actually supposed to be like um. It's more like uh. It's not a code. It should, it should be like, uh, instead of like, um. Yeah. It should be like, uh. It should be like a sound. That's interesting. So we use um as a crutch too. Right, but if I'm making just like, hmm, uh. Mm. Instead of um, it's different. Um sounds stupid. Uh sounds like a think. You're, you're actually thinking. Are we outside? We outside, baby. We outside! Woo! We ain't it. usually outside, nah. They see you, baby. Mm -hmm. Oh. Okay. Oh, this is my outside outfit. Okay. Oh. Oh. Let's go. Yeah, okay. All right, let's see what you're working with. Oh, okay. Okay, okay. You look at all cool Thank and shit. That's good, that's that body. Hey, boo. Why you so fucking cute though? Why you so fucking What the fuck is that? <laughs> Body. Baby, your skin is popping right now. By hey, Raven. Yes. Yeah. 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 Where? No. Yeah. Tell me, your skin is popping right oh. now. Stop it, traffic. Ah! Oh. There it is. Ooh. Ooh. Let's Let go. me see the lady. We missing. Hey, no, we're hey. missing Maya. You want to see the lady? Hi, babe. Coming out with us. Where is it? Hold on, did I get the address right? Oh, Lord, baby. I might have had the address wrong. Baby done sent us to the wrong damn address. Oh, we here in North Street Street, right? I don't know. I don't know the address. Oh, I hear it over there. Huh? I hear music. Oh, you do? Yeah. I don't know. You don't hear it? No. All right, y'all, we playing scavenger hunt. It must be in here. Find a motherfucking club. We found it because I was lost. I ain't know. Lost and found. All right, we're about to head in. Kind of a little cute spot, as y'all see. We about to head in, and we will um talk to y'all later. Hi, Ready? Thank, thank you. Thank you. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. I double the bed, I'm in the stretch, from south to the west. Go is the best, get home with a check. He done fucked up, put some dough on his head. Can't be not done, left the nut on the left. When it catch up like a motherfucking trick. Yeah, yeah. Nigga fucked up, tryna hide the vibe. If you wanna stick on the side of switch. Call up a little bitty vibe, pull up and let him outside the dick. All right. All that you knew why, we were putting swerve in our kind of shit. Whipping and running, my little niggas pulling a gun and they hit when they trying to shine. I started running, we shooting rest right in their stomachs and leaving them inside.
What up, y'all? I'm taking over baby shit. All right, so, um, actually, my homegirl, she was DJing when we got in there, as you saw, and her mix was pretty damn good. I'm not drinking. This is um, probably the second time we've been out now where, um, you know, there's dancing and music involved, and so you know, we're going out. Usually, I will have a drink, and it's, it's weird because I always... I guess thought that I mean just having a shot or two just brings the energy up even fucking more you know turned up even more but I'm quickly learning that you don't need none of that to have fun as long as you around some good energy you with the right people my baby oh no nah, you good yeah, yeah. Hey, shout it out. What's name? It's Young Fat Reezy. You know what I'm saying? Oh, the one of those. Oh, what, Fat Ron. That's an Instagram. Not my my Instagram, Fat Reezy. Yeah, but I'm Fat Ron. You know. I follow, follow, follow Fat yeah. Ron, man. Yeah. All right. <laughs> you see? <laughs> Just a video now. Ooh. It's giving boss bitch. Period. Zakia. Embody. Ooh. Ooh. One more time. Ooh. Aye, aye, aye. <laughs> I, I picture being the least five of them bitches asses inside the club. I know. And like, I'm telling I, you to calm your ass down. I don't know. I was feeling like maybe I need to get out of my stress. Well, and I was like, Push me to that point. I'm about to whoop your You've ass. You've never been Seriously. in a fight in your life. Listen, so. but I know I will beat a bitch ass. I was like, ah, just try me. Mm -hmm. Try me. It's like, right now, nobody needs to fuck with me in my life right now because I will want to fight them. I'll never, I've never felt that way. But right now, I want to beat a bitch ass. Why? Why all the aggression? I have a lot of aggression. I think I just been like it's a lot of like you know stress and shit like that. Like I wanted, I'm I was just thinking like if somebody pushed me to the point to have to fight them, that with all my aggression that I have right now, with just like I will fuck 